Hey good people, first day of October, after a long time we want to solve some puzzles together, you will see my struggle, let's see how it goes. So we have a simple attack running here, for example, we can give up a knight, attacking the queen, and after takes we take back with the other knight, and still attacking the queen, and then we can take this bishop, but it doesn't work, right, because takes with the knight. So it doesn't work. What else do we have? What else do we have? Ah, uh, we may have an a uh, big attack running. I'm not sure if that's true, or if it's just a dream. So our bishop is attacking this direction. Another bishop is also attacking this direction. In a good day. If we didn't have these two knights and we had our queen somewhere like here, then next, uh, then we could no, we only could mate at here, queen at here. So we need queen to be di in diagonal with bishop and mate here. Another thing I see, it's a little bit strange to talk about it, is that if this rook wasn't here and the pawn on g wasn't there, then we could attack the pawn on h for example bringing the rook here taking this pawn and then once it takes with the king we attack with the queen give a check and looks very promising i don't know what is the defense against this because at the end i have i have a check with the knight when the, if king goes to for example g7 i have a check with the knight that somewhere i have attack to the queen and then this releases my bishop and um, when queen is there it can mate over there looks very promising and um, but i don't see a concrete move sequence idea looks promising but we should find a concrete move order so what is forcing move one other forcing move i see is that i take here i think in queen if moves the queen, I grab the uh, rook. If takes, I take with the check. Cannot do anything but move the king to the black square. And then I release the bishop and yeah, it looks very good, right? Okay, no here. If it was going to the other black squares, then moving the knight was enough. But here, still I guess moving the knight is enough because yeah i attack the no, queen for example and no i uh, i attack the queen from here i attack the queen from here releasing my bishop takes i take the bishop takes with the queen i cannot mate so everything looks good but not perfect mm, unfortunately we couldn't give a check from here right this is a bad this is a badly blocked a square because of a strong knights of black what would be the continuation here uh, do we have any other check coming? Uh, I mean, I can see a slow moves like bringing the rook here, going there, but this is too slow, or it feels too slow. Mm. So what if I attack the queen? Uh, even if I attack the queen, queen goes to c6 and attacks my g pawn queen goes there and attacks to and to g pawn so it's not a very wise move it doesn't need to grab my knight to give me a no, give me time to play so it wasn't bishop there i could go check there and next release my knight and be able to treat and mate but it's not a seal mate so i should find a completely different way um what if we take this takes with the queen right hmm. 
take to the queen and we don't have much. If it wasn't there, then maybe we could take this pawn and be very made, but doesn't look good yet. What if we bring the rook here? Then attacks our G pawn. It cannot attack the G pawn because we attack the queen and bishop with the bishop. It could attack our queen, for example. And it doesn't look good. So if I do anything nonsense, for example, knight uh, c5 attacks the queen, I should move the queen somewhere. And it is not in a best position anymore. So what to do? Hmm. Difficult puzzle. Difficult. Or or because I'm explaining it's difficult for me. I don't know. Sometimes I feel when I explain it's much more difficult. What do you think? Is it uh, similar for you? Because uh, you lose the focus a little bit. And I'm not a grandmaster. And it's a long time I didn't provide a video. So I need some time to get back on track. Hmm. What is the forced move here? I wish I was going live so that you could comment here. So, forced move. Knight d5. Taking the queen takes with the bishop. We take back. What is the threat? Nothing. There is no threat. Or there is. Ah. Hmm. Uh, I'm thinking maybe at some point if I could expel the king to the how could I expel the king to the g7? Do I have any check? No check. Uh, no. Yeah, I was thinking expel the king to g7 by by some moves like bishop g7 for example but still bishop g7 doesn't work because it takes with the knight and if it works uh, even if it works it's not useful because the bishop itself plays a big role there so maybe i'm thinking too much about a piece that is not supposed to play here maybe it's not bishop wants, uh, who wants to be involved what else can come i can see for example the knight can come here here and somewhat mate here but this is three moves and we don't have time for three moves probably or maybe we have oh you can even come here and attack the queen and block the bishop pass so What else do we have? Do I need to go with... Uh, okay, let's calculate this. Rook takes bishop. Queen takes a rook. And we are already down a piece. We sacrificed the piece. So we are down a whole rook for a couple of pawns. For two pawns. If we do this sack. Exchange sack. We will be down a whole rook. Takes with the queen... And I cannot take with the queen because takes with the knight. Right. And my queen doesn't have a good place to go. Uh, okay, I, uh, I'm double thinking about this. I go there, queen goes to c6. Then I take the bishop with check, takes with the, yeah, takes with the knight and says, have a good day. Hmm, very difficult for me. <gasps> I see, 
Why I can't play bishop there and bishop there? Oh, because my pawn is blocking me. <laughs> what a crazy question. Sometimes life is hard. Oh, it's a real struggle right now. So I don't see any good continuation. I just think this long... Uh, look, uh, long looking sequence is the most promising one but this can be cancelled easily by playing bishop takes knight I take with the rook I really have no idea what would be the continuation then uh, um, yeah this bishop is blocked this is very bad if bishop wasn't blocked very easy move was to play bishop there. Attacking here and putting more pressure. Oh, what? Uh, I didn't want to do that. Sorry. I shit. So let's do the move that I was thinking uh, and then ask. Yeah, I should move the knight. And this we thought, but what is the continuation? I should have moved the knight and then takes. Then what's the continuation? This is ah, we are attacking. No, what is wrong with this? Ah, yeah, I didn't see this, right? No, wait a moment. No, we are attacking what? No, what's wrong? Let's say it plays here. Yeah, I saw this, I saw this, but then what's the continuation? I, I, I really don't know. See, this is after three, four moves after the initial move, and I still. Uh, just uh, just saying and I still we are uh, just know we are seeing something is happening still we are somehow equal okay then we are up a couple of pawns after after many moves you know now here is where the puzzle ends okay here is where the puzzle ends and we are done a piece for two pawns and then you should calculate every possible movement and you should think about next sacrifice. I mean, it's just too much. For example, what if it takes this one? You know, it's too much. It's just too much to be considered. You know, it's uh, I, I really don't know what was the rating of this puzzle. Uh, I really don't know how people can solve it. I didn't. I want to know your opinion. Is it like logical to have like three, four move, five move, six moves after the continue after the end, and I still, you yeah, it's not clear. <laughs> These are like engine puzzles, you know. Uh, engine says that this is a puzzle, and they suggested then here it uh, looks like much easier. I go there, attacking the queen, then take that pawn, attacking queen again. Where does the queen go? Queen takes the pawn. Uh, so this first move is forced, right? Or can I take the pawn? No, this is a forced move. So, no. No, I'm thinking pushing this pawn. Pawn takes. Then... Uh, oh, pawn doesn't take. It takes the other pawn with the queen. So, taking this pawn. The problem with this is that queen can escape in this situation. But it doesn't matter. We can mate. Right? Because... Oh, okay. I will show you why we can mate. Oh, what happened? What's this? Uh, oh, okay. This is the new... Uh, structure of chess.com. Okay, let me uh, show you what happens if here queen doesn't take, for example, queen goes there. We can mate, right? Because goes here, yeah, I can uh, try a little bit, but it doesn't work, right? This is a mate, a back rank mate, somehow, especially this pattern that you see queen and rook are uh, queen diagonal defends the rook and they together push the king to the back so sort of back rank mate okay here we take the pawn we check black has to take with the rook and then it's mate 
No, black. Uh, okay, we take the pawn with the check. Black doesn't take the. Uh, take the bishop with the rook. Just plays king h8. Plays king h8, and then the problem here is that. Um, king h8. The problem. Okay, I'm talking about this taking placing king h8. Then we go there, for example, we think we won um, with uh, discovery check, but actually no, we didn't, or somewhere like here, we didn't because queen takes queen, and, okay, queen takes queen, and we take with the rook, check, king goes to g7 this time, and, yeah, we can... Win exchange probably, but uh, get back exchange, but doesn't seem to be a right call. Mm. Okay. So, what else we have? We have a check from here as well, but it doesn't look good, right? Oh, it looks good. We have a check from here. Uh, if king goes back. Uh, no, it doesn't look good. Uh, oh, yeah, it looks good, maybe. And we have a check from here. King goes back. We grab the queen with the queen, grabs with the rook, and then what's the continuation? Nothing. So now um, bishop take h7 looks like the best move, even if it is, even if we don't find the um, best continuation. Yeah, okay, best continuation is easy, right? We uh, take, we take, we say check. And we can also say check, but then it's not. Very good. So, what's this? We got another 20 points. Uh, just one thing I wanted to show you here was that after takes, takes, we go there. Okay. Uh, we go there, goes there. Um, we could say check, but the rook goes back and then it's not good for us. Right? So, not all checks are useful. Yeah, I'm still a little bit pissed because of the first puzzle. That um, that was too hard, I would say. Like was like engine puzzle. Hmm. So I take this pawn, attacking the knight. I make my king vulnerable to the attack of uh, black. But on the other hand, uh, his king is in very bad position. I also don't see any good, any good other move actually. Ah, I have already good move. Like even playing king there looks like good move, right? Because because what? It cannot say check. It can say check with the other rook. So I just want to take it, and we are attacking the rook. Should save the rook, and then we can't grab the knight probably, right? We are attacking the rook. Rook goes somewhere, then we next take the knight. Okay, gives up the rook. For what reason? I don't know. No, I just grab this. Oh no! Come on! Come on! We try. Do we have a mate? I think I had to take this and then take this. But yeah, no, no, I know this tricky puzzles. Mm, I had to double check. Okay, I I took this and what was the problem here? It was mate. It was mate in one. Come on, man. Okay, today we had a big, big struggle. We, I think we dropped some rating. Yeah, we dropped a rating point. We were around 3,300, no 3,200. 70 and among my friends i'm ranked two that's interesting that's interesting and uh, the puzzle that was very annoying it was this very annoying puzzle 
was 2700. I mean, how in earth this is 2700? It was very annoying. And um, for example, this was, it was 3100 and we solved it relatively easily. This move was clear. And then we had a little bit of a struggle to, until we discovered, okay, we can have this continuation to grab the rook. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this puzzle set. I will share more of my struggles with you in the upcoming days. And yeah, hope you enjoy.